Hey everyone and welcome back. Today we're showing Casey another movie she's never seen. We're still in our comedy era. We're watching old school. This one was brought up a lot back when we had reacted to Wedding Crashers mm -hmm. and I guess Luke Wilson's in it. Luke Wilson's in this. Why. Will Ferrell's in this as well uh, as Vince Vaughn. That's oh, what I'll tell you. Okay, that makes sense then why everybody was bringing it up then. <laughs> because we were just got done kind of a little bit before that doing the other guys mm -hmm. if I'm not mistaken too and then Get Hard which yeah. is another Will Ferrell mm -hmm. movie. So kind of connecting the dots there, even though it's a different Wilson brother, you know, with Wedding Crashers. So this actually came out before Wedding Crashers for sure. Um, actually before all those movies. Yeah, it definitely came out before all these movies. This came out in the early 2000s, if I'm not mistaken. It was directed by Todd Phillips, who actually made The Joker. Mm. Ironically enough, but you probably know him more from The Joker, but before he got into that, he was kind of a comedy director. Mm. He directed this movie, he directed uh, Starsky and Hutch, he directed the Hangover trilogy, he also directed, if I'm not mistaken, Road Trip, which a lot of you guys were commenting for us to watch that movie as well, which Casey's never seen, mm. I have seen, don't really remember it too much. This one I remember a little bit more. But other than Luke Wilson, I don't know anything about this movie. It's called Old School, so I mean like that is kind of broad, but also kind of specific. I don't know, are they gonna be like retro? I don't know, <laughs> I don't retro? know. I don't know. <laughs> but before we jump into this movie, as we've been asking you recently, drop your recommendations for comedies down below. We're gonna be in this little era for a while. We might, you know, mix it up, throw in a different type of genre movie every once in a while, but we're really loving the comedy kick we're on right now. DreamWorks logo is always like nostalgic. It reminds me of like Shrek, if I'm not mistaken. I think that was like DreamWorks was a Shrek. Wait, vice versa. <laughs> DreamWorks was, <laughs> was a, a Shrek, Shrek movie. movie. <laughs> oh, lawyers? Cassette? It's already old school. Oh my gosh. <laughs> so do you have a beat on like what this movie's about yet? No. Is he going home? He has a teddy bear. Heidi? Oh gosh, is she cheating? Oh, God. I knew it. For a second there, I thought that, uh, is this what you do when I'm gone? Mitch, wait. I mean, I do it myself uh, every once oh in a while. Oh, my like, gosh. Magazines. Okay, Mitch, we need to talk. Hello. Ah! <laughs> How am I going to edit this? Partial on Patreon. Well, do you want me to be honest? Or do you want me to tell you that this Oh, is my gosh. So she, oh, man. I tried to tell you about this. When? <laughs> when we're in bed and stuff. Leave her! Hello. Who are you? Yeah, I'm here for the gangbang. Oh my <laughs> god! <laughs> That's Todd Phillips too, by the way, the director. I feel like that comes around, what, once every hundred years? This is an inappropriate time to have this conversation. Columbus wasn't looking for America, my man, but that seems to work out for everybody, didn't it? <laughs> okay, you need to walk away from this ASAP. Oh my gosh! You need to get out, Frankie. She's about to walk down the aisle. This is it, Frank. It's now or never. You get out of here while you're still single. <laughs> this is the best thing that's ever happened to me. Once you get that six months, you don't think that's going to change? I got a wife. Gosh. Kids. Do I sound like a happy guy to you, Frankie? Well, that sounds like a you problem. It takes a man to give away an angel. <laughs> After all that shit he was saying? We are gathered here together to join Franklin and Marissa. Don't do it. <laughs> Pissing me off. <laughs> I hate you. <laughs> Oh my god, Meredith Grey! I've never seen her in anything other than Grey's Anatomy, so this is wild. We had a dog. She's going through it. Had a great place. She kept the dog after that Aww, bullshit? Oh, you should have taken the dog. I think you should have some of this. What's in this one? Coffee. Coffee. Ow! Oh my gosh! I am so sorry. Please, no, just don't straight. touch. Just no! Hun? Yeah? Why don't you get some air, okay? No, get off. wait a second, wait a second. He needs like a bottle of water. We're not gonna go anymore. Yes. Oh, okay. <laughs> I thought you just like did all that. Uh, oh my gosh. I know this is a movie, but I hate when people ruin other people's weddings. Sometimes you think you have true love, and then you catch oh the early goodness. flight home from San Diego, and a couple of nude people jump out of your bathroom ready to double team your girlfriend. And it continues right here because I think what my friend Mitch is trying to say is that true love is blind. <laughs> <laughs> Way to turn it around. Oh my gosh. 
Yeah, he was there to save it at yeah. the end. Why is that picture of Will Ferrell? He's like all <laughs> bewildered. <laughs> After all that shit he talked. I thought you said near campus. This is practically on campus. It's sick. He's moving in here? A little housewarming. To, to new beginnings. Actually, I gave this to you for your uh, wedding. Oh gosh, he regifted. We are gonna get so much ass here, it's gonna be sick. I'm talking like crazy, like boy band ass. Aren't you married with children? What we need to do is throw like a big kick off, like kick ass party to start Absolutely. things off here. Break it in a little. I was kinda hoping we might get to those thank you nights tomorrow night. I got Mitch's thing tomorrow night. Just as long as you promise to take it easy, you know? You've come a long way since Frank the Tank, and we don't want him coming back. Frank now, the Tank? You? Like what, Frank with drinking? He's not coming back, okay? I feel like Frank the Tank's coming out. <laughs> Mitch <-a> Palooza. <laughs> all going through a midlife crisis. <laughs> I thought we were just having a small get together. This is a small get together. It's like trying to vicariously live through him. What else have you got planned? Uh, like a student band or something? Bitch, I own six speaker cities. I'm worth three and a half million dollars that the government knows about. What? <laughs> oh, he owns speaker city. I was like, yeah. what is speaker city? That's why he's got the he advertisement there. <laughs> he's a sponsor. Hey, yo, man, come hit this right here. You need to hit this. Oh, oh gosh, he's going to be Frank the Tank. Okay, you know what? You know what? Give me that thing. Oh, no. Here he goes. Now. Courtesy of Speaker City. Speaker City. Mr. Snoop Dogg. For real? <laughs> no way. It's not. Who, who is it? Oh my <laughs> god. Why would you have Snoop Dogg? What? Thinking up a master plan. Dang. <laughs> Connections. Dude, that's the second one. Oh no. He's totally tanking. Frank the tanking. I guess I just don't understand why you do beer bongs if you could just do shots. Because it's so much less liquid. <laughs> Cheaters in this movie. Hey, you're that guy. Mitch Palooza from the poster. It's kind of a weird way to put it. Say make money, money, make money, money, money. Make money, money, make money, money, money. Money, money, make <laughs> money, 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 money. <laughs> oh my gosh! We're good streaking! <laughs> <laughs> you ruined Snoop Dogg's set! No, I'm sorry. Oh my gosh. <laughs> We're going streaking! Like a year on college kid, like the way they're talking. Come on, everybody, we're going. Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody paid attention to. We're streaking. Come on. Come on, everybody. We're running. Come on. Oh we're my streaking. god. We're streaking. <laughs> so we're streaking. Dog. <laughs> <laughs> my friend Ashley had this guy come over and teach a class. <laughs> Why am I looking at that? Wait <laughs> so till you figure out who it is. Right. <laughs> He's like, I recognize oh that flabby gosh. ass. How far did he get? <laughs> Look how you married. Hey, honey. <laughs> hey. What the hell are you doing? We're streaking. Oh, We're through the quad to the gymnasium. Who's streaking? <laughs> Frank, get in the car. Everybody's doing Where? Yeah. Where's Where's gonna sit? Doing? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Frank, looks like it's a little cold out there, huh? <laughs> Honey, do you think KFC's still open? <laughs> <laughs> KFC? <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, oh my gosh. Wow. They're like a Project X style party. Good morning. <gasps> now that was a party. I just got out of a very serious and traumatic relationship. And a... <laughs> <laughs> Why'd you laugh? Relax, Rich. It's not a big deal. Mitch. <laughs> Okay. Rich. Love you. Oh my gosh. Hello. Yeah, come on in. Jeez. Who is this? Why did you just walk in? Wow, cheese. Cheese? Actually, my name isn't Cheese anymore. It's Gordon Pritchard. Can we lock you in a dumpster one time? I got out. Whoa. <laughs> I got out. I'm the dean, Dean Pritchard. Oh. And as of this morning, this house has been rezoned. It is now exclusively for campus use only. Didn't he just buy it? You can't just do that. I've already paid the first and last month's rent. Oh, he's renting. You have a week to vacate the premises, and I thank you for your cooperation. Dang. Good seeing you guys. It looks like you're doing great. Made an enemy when you were young. It came back to haunt you. <laughs> They're in therapy. I look over at a certain point during the meal and see a, a, a waitress taking an order, and, uh, and I find myself wondering uh, what color her underpants <laughs> might be. Okay. <laughs> Maybe you should have uh, heeded the advice of your friend uh, and not got married. This is wild that all this is coming out after y'all got married. Maybe they're silk. Annie. 
things. Maybe maybe it's maybe it's a thong. <laughs> Honestly, like even if that was on your mind, why are you <laughs> why are you saying this? What? What? I thought we were in the trust tree with in the nest. Are we not? It doesn't absolve you from what you're saying. <laughs> Well, actually, I'm, I'm familiar with that idea. Honey. Hi, Dad. Am I interrupting? No. Oh, no. it's the I'm daughter. Darcy, this is Mitch Martin. <laughs> Awkward. Hi, nice to meet you, Mitch. It's Rich. How was the slumber party? Oh, my God. I mean, it was a slumber party. <laughs> uh, I don't know about that. To think that in just seven months, you're going to be graduating from high school. <gasps> what? <laughs> I thought you said high school. Oh, my gosh. Shocking, isn't it? I mean, she's at least 18, right? I mean, you would hope you can graduate at 18. Or she turned 18 at the beginning of the year. So, Frank's here. He got kicked out. Are y'all getting an annulment? I thought maybe I could crash here tonight. That's all right. Marissa's going through some, some personal stuff. You're she? the personal stuff. We're discussing a brand new way to look at a fraternity. In other words. What? Why is he just coming in here and taking over his house? Because this is a very big idea, my friends. Also, doesn't he need to vacate? What's he doing right now? Making a fraternity. Oh, so that it's like a loophole? Because it's campus related. How long have these people been in my house? They've been here all day. That party that we had last night has given us all kinds of street cred. Street cred? <laughs> Mitch, this is called Rush. We are officially starting a fraternity. <laughs> None of us are enrolled in the college. Okay. We got 40 guys out there that want this. There must be a reason for it, Mitch. They're all in college, of course. <laughs> trying to figure out why I take time out of my schedule just to try to help you get over earmuffs. That whore that you dated. <laughs> Uncle Mitch is sorry. How come he's the one who actually was coming up with the solution, though? Yeah. What the heck? Oh my god. What the heck? All right, here's the deal. Lift it up. Why are you driving so violently? 14 pledges. Uh, <laughs> Who's this guy? Oh, that's blue. Yeah, it's an old Navy vet who hangs around my store a lot. Oh, are they hazing? <laughs> <laughs> okay, hazing doesn't mean we break every street law known to man. Oh my god! <laughs> what the heck? Oh, <laughs> you hazing in front of his wife? Oh my god! <laughs> Old is like 30 year old is like yeah. makes it funny. Oh my gosh, you're gonna get blue a heart attack. Each and every one of you has been handpicked to represent our inaugural pledge class. They do weird shit when they uh bring people into fraternities and sororities. Oh, people die sometimes. You may be asking yourself, why am I holding this 30 pound cinder block in my hand? Oh no, what are they? Their pants are down. Even old blue? Why is the other end of this string tied securely to your penis? Ah! Do you trust that we've provided you with enough slack so that your block will land safely on the lawn? Oh my gosh. Do you trust that I do not want to see you die here tonight? Sir, yes sir. Blue, you're my boy! <laughs> oh no! I'm afraid. I'm so nervous. Who would ever do this? Not me. Prepare to release! Is it worth it? Is it worth the oh, risk? It's not fucking worth Is it. Is the, the risk to worth To join it? a cult? Walk it off, big guy. Walk it. He pro it probably got ripped off. This reminds me of the last movie we just watched. Major, Major, Major Pain. Pain. Go check out our reaction. Is he fine? Looking okay. good? Mm -hmm. Wouldn't that have to have to have gone through him? Don't you have to get approved? <laughs> They've just been approved for temporary status by the student council. Half these guys don't even go to the school. <laughs> he's, the guy, he's like 90. Doesn't even <laughs> blue? How is it even happening? A loophole. A loophole. Oh. Yes. Well, it doesn't make any sense, sir. Uh, as stupid as they appear, they're actually very good at paperwork. Cause they're 30. Well, it's, he's a lawyer too, right? Yeah. Okay, there you go. Always have a lawyer friend. And then the other guy owns like a business yeah. that's like worth millions of you dollars. have an entrepreneurial friend. And then you have the Will Ferrell. He he's... just brings a good time. What's going on, brother? Nothing. I heard you guys are starting up a fraternity. Well, you want in? Well, it sounds cool, man. I want in. These guys. They're like in their 30s in the war force. They just force. like can't let, let it go, the youth. Heard you hooked up with Goldberg's daughter. <gasps> <laughs> How did that get around? The secret. To a good BJ is focus. 
or just some hot sailor you met at TGI. Is Friday. that a tiny dog <laughs> in a shirt? Leave me with a little something called herpes. Oh which no. I then gave to the dog. What the fuck? How did you give it to the dog? I don't even want to fucking know. Oh my goodness. <laughs> He has this all choreographed. He has the Lord Farquaad. The berries and cream. Yeah. Berries and cream. Berries and cream. I'm a little lad who does berries and cream. Thumbs are down. Our wrists are flexed. This is going to be on Patreon. We're not going to see much of this. Yeah. <laughs> the flying and the magic. Oh my goodness. He's going to like... <gasps> oh my gosh. Someone we'll just make a bad mistake. <gasps> Whoa. He has more skills. <laughs> Yes, I'm hurt. He looks a lot more hurt than you. Yeah, when'd you get here? Just a few minutes ago. Is that her? Oh, this is my boyfriend. I'm assuming. Hey, look, she has oh, a Shrek. Oh, she has a boyfriend. And a Shrek toy. <gasps> she has a Shrek. DreamWorks. Uh, somebody told me you guys are in a fraternity. How does everyone fucking know I this know. information? Yeah, we don't take it too seriously. Hey, exactly. Luke, how come there's no ice in my lemonade? <sighs> sir, sorry, sir. You drop down or you get a tan. Oh. Oh. No. What up? Go at it there. What is it? What could it be? Is it that same? <laughs> <laughs> that same thing? A bread maker? <laughs> he doesn't have a lot right now. I'll have one of those. I'm Mark. What's your name? Mm -hmm. how, how long have you two been together? Two years now. Oh, so that's not I the actual dad. I had a crush on you in high school, and I think I got him a little jealous. Oh, oh. why would you say that? You'd be kidding me. I was obsessed with you. Ooh. Not in a dangerous way, you know, I just watched you a lot from a distance. Oh my gosh, you're- just say less, bro, say less. <laughs> <gasps> Why is there so much cheating in this movie? I am bad. <laughs> oh my gosh, break up with him! <gasps> oh, Ooh, sorry. you better tell her. Excuse me, huh? Oh, shut the fuck up. See you in your house. What are you gonna do, tell me? Do it. You know you can, buddy. It's guy code. What? what? Not if you're- for, no. And also, <laughs> you're not even- you don't even know each other. Not a chick, are you? That's not even your mouthwash, bro. Shut <laughs> up! You suck. Go tell her. Steal his girl. Do 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 do. It's Mr. Steel girl. girl. Do, do. Are you grabbing a? Why is there a gun in the horse thing? He's a beauty, ain't you? Hey, Stifler. Stifler. What kind of gun? Is this? <laughs> With a mullet. That's a tranquilizer gun. Oh. Betty, these little fuckers decide to freak out on the kids. <laughs> the pony? Okay. <laughs> there, what? What? <laughs> what the fuck? fuck? It's so, like, tall. It's so small. Not tall. <laughs> That's the most powerful trank gun on the market. Why do you need the most powerful one for these little miniature horses? Ponies. Skin of a rhino from a <gasps> Ow! I, I don't even have any words. Like, <laughs> what? <laughs> That's awesome. Oh my god. You got a fucking dog in your neck. He was the worst person to be by when this happened to you. <laughs> You're not gonna help him oh at all? Gosh. Oh my gosh. Drown. The song. Hello, darkness, my old friend. <laughs> Somebody giving him mouth to mouth. Is it Vince Vaughn? Oh, it's Stifler. <laughs> <laughs> Ew, it's tongue. <laughs> <laughs> this bitch kissed me. <laughs> <laughs> this little uh, fraternity over on Brook Street has become quite an inconvenience and as student body president you approve their temporary status oh that's oh. why okay you alone have the ability to revoke it so we're gonna need you to go ahead and do that well it says here that you are applying to columbia <sighs> law school it's gonna blackmail you know dean pritchard has some serious connections at columbia bribing not blackmail you know there's something i think you should know <sighs> oh my gosh just get out and say it uh, good luck mm. You literally got cheated on. Dinner or something. Oh, but you're not gonna tell her? Oh. Stupid. And then if it comes out that you knew and you didn't say anything at all. Ooh, she's eyeing him. This is so. And, uh, that was a very slow cheat kiss. Excuse oh me, God. sir! Literally, this movie is full of cheating. We can only buy KY jelly in the four ounce tubes. <laughs> oh my gosh. We're screwed. We're screwed? It's Blue's birthday. We're having a KY wrestling match. You know what? <laughs> Blue's birthday! Blue's birthday! 
<laughs> oh, look, cheating on our wife. I like your room. Well, doing balloon. Doing balloon? <laughs> wow. And I'm sorry. I'm, I'm married. I don't know how you acted earlier, and also, why did you get into this position? Tell you what, why don't you go ahead and leave me your number? This way, if something happens to my wife, I can give you. <laughs> Something happens to my wife. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to tonight's main event. His pajamas are like long johns. Oh my gosh, he passed out. Did he die? <laughs> he died. <laughs> What do you think? Not your fault. That's what old people do, they die. <laughs> the old lady! Sing Jimmy's brother. Listen, I'm sorry I didn't call you on your birthday. What the hell? He skipped his birthday? Birthday? What do you mean? Did he forget his birthday? Oh my gosh! <laughs> Maybe we rushed into this, you know? Maybe y'all should like pay attention to who you're actually marrying before you get married. I mean, uh... I think we should get a divorce. That's wild. All he did was run naked one time. Just okay? Yeah. Your boyfriend sucks. I had Mitch take a look at the lease. And Loki, you kind of do too. Had Mitch look at the lease? I'm not so sure about that guy. Shut up. I hate all of you. Something I saw last week at the birthday party. I didn't want to get into this, but. Oh my gosh, he's the worst person. I walked in on him and he was harassing one of the caterers. Oh, you suck. Hello. Nicole, it's Mitch. Oh my gosh. Mm, perfect timing. Hey, that's one pecan pie and Thank two you. coffees. For the Godfather, it's always on the house. How does everyone freaking know? Don't you think this is going a little far? I heard one of your pledges died. Is that true? <laughs> well, he was like 90. But he was really old, and I feel pretty confident that when we get the autopsy back, it'll show you it's <laughs> probably of natural causes. <laughs> Now it's gonna come out that you saw and you didn't say anything. That's why you go around harassing young women. Oh, here it comes out. Caterer at the birthday party. Oh, but then it's gonna sound like yeah, he's just- Yeah, see, that's yeah. what I'm saying. Why didn't you tell her earlier? I didn't want to say anything, but Mark is the one who was acting inappropriate. Why wouldn't you want to say anything? It's true. Hey. Oh my oh gosh! Oh my gosh, she is a young girl oh, with her high hey. school jacket. Hi. I've been meaning to call you. I just oh. high school volleyball. <laughs> I didn't want you to worry about my dad. He doesn't know anything, so it's totally cool. We gotta run because we got this prom committee thing. <laughs> prom committee thing. When it rains, it pours. I have to go. Nicole, please wait a second. No, really. I have to go. I mean, low key, it's not like y'all were dating. I know she had a boyfriend technically. And you still wanted to come here. Love, it's a motherfucker, huh? Y'all aren't even together. You're Mitch. If you're holding this letter, you already know. The house has been boarded up. Oh, okay. Thank you. you. Can't do that. This guy's playing hardball. I mean, y'all aren't even students. Skywalker. What? Still what about Skywalker? Wait, wait, go back to that. I want to hear, hear more about that. Who was supposed to be? Off the record. You do this, you're in. Okay, recruiting more lawyers. Got it. I need to talk to you. Give me five minutes, okay? Oh. Ooh. I want them working the Sunshine Square deal. I locked the Sunshine Square deal yesterday. So wow, look at that. Appreciate it if you let me handle my own team and don't get on Whoa, my ass every stuck time I'm to the man. to do something. All right, I want to make sure you're on top of it. You earned his respect. Say hello to your daughter for me. Got some good news and I got some bad news. What Pritchard did technically is illegal. Pritchard. We're now subject to a charter certification review given by the Board of Trustees. Damn it. Do you even know what that means? What does that mean exactly? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Good luck to everybody. It was nice to know y'all. You started this shit! They need us. Come on, Mitch. College is overrated anyway. True. I built Speaker City from the ground up. I can barely read. <laughs> hey, look at that. Damn thing was your idea and you convinced me to do it. Yeah, you like waltzed right on in here and took over his house. Whose life is ruined? Well, let's see. Blue's dead. <laughs> a man is dead. I lost my house. Nicole thinks I'm a total jackass. And those kids got kicked out of school. We got nine kids. We're gonna get expelled from so school. So there's nine. And you're not even gonna help them out. Yeah, you suck. Okay, they're helping them out. <laughs> the sweater vests. Welcome everyone to the official debate section of the Charter Review. <laughs> this is giving Billy Madison. Topic number one. 
Do they have Will Ferrell as the debater right now? Well, Dean, I'm, I'm glad that you asked that Actually, question. Actually, I'd like to jump in and take that one, Jimmy, if you don't mind. Watch him just know it. Recent research has shown that empirical cool, what? evidence for globalization wow. and corporate innovation is very limited. Innovation policy with emphasis on human resource development. Thank you. <laughs> what the <laughs> heck? Dude, you just, like, become another person for a second? What happened? I blacked out. <laughs> That's the true Frank the Tank. <laughs> Now we're going streaking! That sucks. Oh, they're cheating! How do they not see that or hear that? <laughs> this is like, like a stakeout or something. Harriet's method of solving cubics. Harriet's method of solving Don't all do it at once! That was too suspicious. Good test. <laughs> that was just good test. Frank? Wow. <laughs> I doubt that's him. <laughs> no, that's Will Ferrell. Let's go, Cougars! That's the thing. Uh, oh, <laughs> oh, 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 no. no! He's on fire, literally. Help me! Help me! This reminds me of Ricky Bobby, like, help me, Tom Cruise. I didn't get into Columbia Law School. Oh, oh shit. You said if I revoked their charter, you'd you lied. Columbia. You're right, I did Unrevoke say Unrevoke it. That Columbia has even heard of you. <gasps> In my part, now you have to do yours. That's how bribes work. I know how bribes work. I bribe people all the time, but I changed my mind. It's a free country. Unrevoke them, unrevoke them. Too much to lose. You gotta just keep our composure. Oh my God. <laughs> so elegant, so graceful, lovely. <laughs> okay, okay. Nah, don't worry. Abdul's here to spot you. <laughs> Look the smallest oh. guy y'all got. <laughs> you get him, Abdul. <gasps> oh! <laughs> Ew! <laughs> he stopped the landing! <laughs> Good for you. Didn't even need Abdul. <laughs> I'm afraid I have some bad news for you. You didn't pass your review. What? Fortunately, another pledge of yours scored a zero in every category. Who? Joseph Blue Pulaski. He died! That's so stupid! You suck! Hey, man. Blue's dead. He passed away two weeks ago. He's listed right here on your official chapter oh, roster. The son oh, the Oh, my bitch. gosh. Come on, lawyer him. It's been quite a journey. Cheese, you suck cheese. I recommend you drive off immediately before something extremely bad. <gasps> Ooh, I'm scared. Excuse me, Mitch. I thought you guys might find this interesting. Ooh. If I revoke their charter, you'd get me into Columbia. Ooh, Megan. Let's change my mind. Let me, no, we don't. Bird dog and Frankie. Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. Bird dog. <laughs> oh, we'll spread out. <laughs> oh, <laughs> he just slapped him. Oh, my God. Oh my Whoa. gosh! Like, you're gonna get Assault. away with any of this. Oh my, in front of everybody. It's the Dean! I mean, this should get him fired yeah. right here. This man accosted me! Who is this? He accosted me! Frank! That was completely unnecessary. I'm so cold. <laughs> you're fine. I think I see blue. <laughs> <laughs> you were right about Mark. I caught him red-handed and it wasn't pretty. I guess I thought he could change, you know. So you already knew? I have always been a little curious about what goes on inside these places. You don't want to know. I do have another 12 hours on my lease. I would still be asking questions <laughs> about the high school girl that approached you in the <laughs> diner. <laughs> Hey, Tuesday to you out there. It's Frank the Tank oh. here at Harrison Cooper. Frank the Tank. <laughs> well, there you go. Brand new house on campus located at Dean Pritchard's former residence. Oh, <laughs> they got, dang, that's a nice house. Well, we'd love for you to join us this Saturday at our open house. <laughs> they put up a picture water. of him. Soda and some late night streaking. <laughs> late night streaking. Why don't you give me fresh beer? You serious? Now! <laughs> Oh, the boyfriend! X. The Dean! X. Former Dean. <laughs> <laughs> What's about to happen? 
Oh my gosh. <gasps> Are they all about to die? I don't know why I left. <laughs> Take the most two hated characters and just fucking kill them off in the outro. Only for a moment. <laughs> <and a> moment <laughs> <laughs> oh well. You're a boy, Blue. Blue. Frank, it's Hank. Oh, his ex? Oh. Wow, you're looking very healthy. This is breaking bro code. Well, you know, I'm having this get together at my Oh no, my no. gosh, she's inviting him to him! You should swing by. Swing being the key word. Okay. All right. That sounds awesome. <gasps> you know what happened to your buddy. <laughs> I am back. Probably wouldn't have invited anyone. You know it. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> this was old school. In my opinion, at least falls into that raunchy comedy. I don't think it's the most raunchy comedy that I've ever seen. Watching this when I was younger, I didn't realize how horrible so many people were in the movie. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. They were all kind of awful. Yeah. In Except for Mitch. different ways. Except for he didn't tell her. Yeah. About the cheating. True. But then also, like, I'm just trying to say he's probably the least right. horrible. Besides Blue. Blue is cool. Right. <laughs> yeah, interesting movie. I definitely was not what I was expecting, but like I guess it makes sense like old school and they were like at this college But mm. they were all just I guess trying to like be like a fraternity and like party and stuff yeah. But yet they were all like 30 and like some of them were married and yeah, some marriages got ended <laughs> yeah. But some marriages a lot, probably a lot of drama those marriages probably shouldn't have happened. Yeah <laughs> There are definitely some funny moments in this one, but I feel like I preferred Wedding Crashers a little bit more um, A lot more actually. just comparing like you know with yeah. a of Vince Vaughn and uh, another Wilson brother in there. I will say I think I liked Wedding Crashers significantly more than this one. I think this one has some very funny moments. As a whole, I still like it, but it's not as good as I remembered, in all honesty. I think the streaking part was like yeah, hilarious. Yeah. Like, you're my boy blue will yeah. stick with me like for life. <laughs> but those were like the two biggest moments that I remembered from this movie. Besides the very beginning when Mitch walked in on his like girlfriend and then just like discovered what he discovered. Uh, that was memorable, but not like in a quotable way. I just remember like that was like um, the plot point that kind of propelled the movie into like the plot that ended up developing. Uh, but yeah, you're my boy blue and we're going streaking past the or through the something into the gymnasium. Yeah. <laughs> I, I will always remember that. Like I think I've I don't think I've said that to Casey. But I feel <laughs> like I've said like you're my boy blue at some point in time. I like I quote he movies says sometimes. All, all kinds of quotes all the time and then I never know what they're from until we watch the movies and I'm like, oh. <laughs> Casey just realized uh, in our last reaction to major pain. Uh, that I quote like well not this isn't quote because it's a laugh but I was like he he yeah he, he I got that from Major Pain and then we end up finding out well not we she ends up finding out later on through these movies and these reactions that I actually got a lot of the things that I say throughout my life from movies which is kind of funny and like Casey's like discovering not only yeah. these not only cinema but she's also discovering more about me. <laughs> <laughs> like we said before, drop some comments down below of your favorite comedy movies and let us know what you want to see us react to next.